Hello and welcome to Let's Play Sonic Robo Blast 2. I'm going to be doing uh, Nitric Citadel Zone and Sunken Plant Act 3 in this one. Uh, Nitric Citadel is in the same sort of setup as the original uh, Sunken Plant 1 and 2. It's inside a factory and there's water and stuff. Uh, the difference is this water is green water and green water instantly kills you. And that's pretty much it. It's, um, it's like Silver Cavern, in essence, in that it's lots and lots of platforming over disguised... Well, Silver Cavern isn't exactly disguised, but over void zones. Um, it's quite a short act, and it has a section uh, in the middle of it that uh, I used to think was absolutely balls hard, but it turns out that isn't really the case, and it's just that I hadn't realised a crucial factor about that section, uh, which I'll point out when I get there. Uh, but, as I said, this is a fairly short level, all things considered. I actually think it's easier than Silver Cavern, personally. Um, that's because I'm horrible at Silver Cavern, because I hate the ice. Alright, please stop shooting in a second, so I can just grab that in safety. Yep. Oh, cock. That was really stupid of me. I jump jumped out of split second too soon. And I'm going to get shot at, I think. Careful. There's a robot there, though. there we go. Right, now, over here. And I'm pretty much there. Yep, I'm at the right section. Now, this room, uh, it goes up and down the floor. I'll, I'm going to grab the rings while I talk about it, because uh, I'm going to need the lives sooner or later. Um, basically, there's a hallway that you can see there, and then near the end of the hallway, there is a 90 degree turn into a smaller hallway and then you have to go through a series of um, small hallways and 90 degree turns to get to the end in safety. I uh, used to mistakenly believe that you had to make it all the way through this section in one go. Uh, right where the corners are for the hallway, it turns out there is actually a small um, uh, alcove in the ceiling for you to hide in, which is very, very nice and handy. It means I can actually do this section now, unlike uh, last time I played the game. Oh, crap. I, honestly, for a second, then I thought I killed myself. Right, there it is. Yep, tiny alcove to sit and hide in. As I said, you can get a lot of rings in this level very easily, so I'm uh, making the most of that. Okay, get those last two in a second. Uh, come on. I'm well aware that I'm probably going to lose all of my rings, but uh, it'll be worth it to get the extra two back, because that will recompensate me for the one I lost in Silver Cavern and Sunken Plant. More or less. Alright, that's all those done. Now I'll just wait for the floors and make it through this hallway. Uh, there we go, done. Now at the top of here are some speed shoes and a gun. Oh, okay. Oh wait, no, I have the cover of the... Yeah, this is the uh, problem I have with this section, in that it's... Oh, oh I fell off. Shit. Well, I did manage to squeeze the uh, other life in, just about right at the end. Uh, now I'm back here. I'm not going to bother recollecting all the lives, all the rings. I, I mean, I probably could squeeze enough rings together to get 100 by the end of the stage, but I really don't want this video to take, like, 15 minutes, when all that's really left in terms of difficulty is uh, that room. Now this time I'm going to wait until it's all the way up and stand on it to get ready. Now then. Uh, right, okay, let's do this. Done. Now I just need to get out of there and through this bit. Okay, that's all the difficult part of this level done. Now I just have to do, uh, oh dear. Yep, on this left is a couple of rooms and then the Chaos Emerald. I don't know if this section is like isn't finished or something, but um, or never just was never finished. But it's really really easy after the uh, last part. So a helipad and up here into the control room sort of area. There is an extra life and a load of rings on there, but I do not dare uh, risk going to get them. And here we are in the control room, chaos emerald and signpost. Phew, I, had to, despite, I used to think that was really hard, but I honestly rate it easier than um, Silver Cavern, having had experience it now. And now Sunken Plan 3, which is again the uh, Tempest Valley boss of a remix, except now there is a tiny arena to fight. Although the room is large, um, as you can see I've just taken like 
nearly a quarter of it away. Um, that's pretty much the theme for this part of this boss fight. Um, the you can it's very difficult to see, but the texture is a bit different. Um, where the texture is a bit different are the ones that collapse, and that is most of the arena. So you sort of have to fight him um, and only hit him when it's uh, when he's perpendicular to one of these. Yeah, I just collapsed that one by accident. Yeah, the easy way to kill him is just to fight him like this. Time to get in a sneaky hit. Oh no, I don't. I'm drown if I'm not careful. Yep, I'm probably gonna drown now. Oh come on, give me a bubble, please. I really do not like. Thank you. I really do not like this boss. Right, when he comes back round. No, I'm gonna miss. And oh, thank God for that. <sighs> oh, I just went through him again. Really. <sighs> I'm gonna leave some rings this time. Come on, Robotnik. Come on. Oh, for God's sake, come on. Why can't I hit him? Why does everything hate me? Are you gonna be nice enough to give me a bubble or are you just gonna drown me this time? Nope. He's still playing nice, thank god for that. This boss has already gone on for about a minute longer than I would have liked. I think that was hit four or five, one of the two. Now I have to be really careful about how, uh, how, how I hit him. Or oh, for fuck's sake. Are you going to play nice? Yeah, at least the, the bubbles seem to be give, they're dispensing them out uh, on a fairly decent basis for me, so. And that, oh, for a second then I thought I'd just kill myself. I think I hear him chasing me now. Yeah, please give me a bubble quick, I just don't want to get caught by him, that's all. Is he stuck in the pit? Can I actually hit him here? Yep. Oh, for fuck's sake! I knew that was going to happen. I hate this boss. Jesus Christ. Ah, oh, let's try that again. Well, that's one platform squandered. Oh, nope, missed. I really... Oh, for fuck's sake. Now I'm getting impatient and I really need to stop that. I easily consider this the worst boss in the game. And I'm stuck in the wall now. Great. There we go. Bubble. Thank you. Platform gone. Might as well attack him from the other side now. Get a quick hit. Oh, did I tag that yet? Nope, I'm gonna need to go and get it. Seriously, I think probably I think I've hit him once so far in fucking a minute. Stupidest boss. Also, then he does things like fucking change direction on you with no rhyme or reason or warning. Right, missed him. Right, one. Oh fuck. Okay, that was close. That was a bit a bit riskier than I anticipated, to be honest. Nope. Bubble, 
here, please. This boss is a fucking grade A example of evil horn swoggling. Also, yeah, this it's about this point where the uh, questionable game design begins to kick in. I did originally like to cite um, Nitric Citadel for that, but I actually grew to like Nitric Citadel, so... Oh, come on. Are you going to give me a bubble, or are you going to kill me? You're going to... Ah, oh, nice. See, also, this is my problem, in that he's just... Both times, when I've got him down this low, he's just got... Stop. I can't even work out where his hitbox is. And he's tossed me... Yep, yeah, fuck's sake! For whatever reason, whenever I get the sixth hit, he's just getting stuck in the ground, and then I can't actually hit him safely. Bullshit. Right. I fucking knew that I would lose more lives here than I did in Nitric Citadel. Nitric Citadel is easy compared to this shit boss. Am I stuck in the wall? Yep. Yeah, I am. Oh, okay. I managed to get out but by squandering a platform. Great. Right, see if I can get a hit or two on him like this. Uh, no, I can't. Because sticks. Really? Fucking Robotnik? Christ almighty. Uh, no, I'm gonna have to wait and see if the game decides I should drown. No. Think that was it for? Not entirely sure. Oh, that was hit miss. probably gonna get stuck in the ground and throw me to my death again, but whatever. No, he's not this time. He's gonna... Come on. Think... Th yeah, I'm safe. Thank Christ for that. And 159. That was entirely too many deaths lost there, but never mind. It's done, and now I get to do the most awful zone. So I will see you in the next update for Aerial Garden Zone.